In this video, you will learn how to set up the TriCaster Mini X. For further training and education, please visit newtech.com slash newtech u. To begin setting up the TriCaster Mini X, the following items will be required. A monitor or display with HDMI or DisplayPort connections, an HDMI or DisplayPort cable, an Ethernet cable to connect to the Internet, a video source with an HDMI or NDI connection. Step 1. Connect to power. Connect the IEC cable to the included power supply. Then connect the power supply to the TriCaster Mini X power connector located here. Next, plug the power cable into a power outlet. Step 2. Connect a monitor or display. Use one of the four included mini DisplayPort adapters to connect to your monitor. In this example, we will be using a mini DisplayPort to HDMI adapter seen here to connect to a monitor. Connect the mini DisplayPort adapter to the mini DisplayPort here. It can be connected to any of the four mini DisplayPort connectors on the rear of the TriCaster Mini X. Connect the HDMI cable into the connected mini DisplayPort adapter, then connect the other end of the HDMI cable into the monitor or display. Step 3. Keyboard and Mouse Connect the keyboard and mouse to any of the USB connections located here. Step 4. Connect to the Internet. Connect a network or Ethernet cable to either of the gigabit network ports located here. Connect the other end of the network cable to your network. This connection is not necessary for operation, but will be required for initial setup. Step 5. Connecting video sources. You can connect HDMI video sources such as cameras, computers, gaming systems, and other video devices to integrate into your production using one of the four HDMI ports located here on the rear of the TriCaster Mini X. Step 6. Analog Audio Connections On the front of the TriCaster Mini X are six quarter-inch audio connectors. The top left connector is used for connecting a microphone. The bottom two connectors are used for stereo line level audio inputs. The top right connector is used for connecting headphones. And the bottom two connectors on the right are used for line level audio outputs. Step 7. Turn on the TriCaster Mini X. To turn on the TriCaster Mini X, press the power button on the top of the device. Step 8. Initial Setup and Registration For this step, you will need an active internet connection. After the unit finishes powering up, you will see the End User License Agreement. Review the agreement and press I Accept to continue. The TriCaster Registration menu will appear. Locate the 15 character serial number printed on your TriCaster Mini X. Type it into the serial number field, along with the other required information to complete your registration. Click Register to continue. You are now in the main TriCaster user interface. Step 9. Updating the system. From the main TriCaster interface, select Shutdown. Then select Administrator Mode. On the left side, select Update TriCaster. A new window will appear. Select Download and Install. Follow the on-screen prompts to complete the update process. After the update process is complete, the system will restart and will load into the main TriCaster interface. Once completed, the system is now set up and ready for use.